Lopez against Ethan. Whoa. I think Alvaro went to the gym during the lockdown. Because yeah, he, he got so even fit on the podium. Yeah, he got so many muscles right now. So. If he does like no touch, I hope the podium can handle yeah, yeah, it. But, uh, so he's 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 a beer man. Yeah, he got big. Let's see if it helps his freestyle. It doesn't necessarily have to. Yeah. So. All right. Ethan is starting. Are you guys ready? Ethan is from France, right? I don't know him really well. Very, very funny. Three, two, one. Let's go. Vamos. All right. Ethan starts. Small mistake. Oh, oh. Paul Ekombo. Shout out to DJ Skogit for the beats. Yes. Yes. There he goes. The note touch is. Yes. Oh! Holy shit! Whoa! He was going to buy us there. I thought it was gonna go like Three, twenty of them. Two, one, oh, it's like that. Eldo. Okay, it's a few old lemons combo. Uh, oh, uh, nice! Yes. Uh, Score around the world and still going with the old lemons. Oh. oh! Not very clean the cross, but no. nice. But he does it like. And you see a bit different in like uh, metal combos or uh, yes. like training combos. In metal, there's more like uh, uh, it, it, it has to be like that clean. Yes, you know? I hear what you're saying. It's true. Of course, like different types of tricks that require different techniques, and you also have different criteria on how to see it if it's clean or not. Yeah. And you have to do it as clean as possible, and it works uh, to get more votes from the judges. But um, yeah, it, it will not count as that much as, as yes. a drum or uh, you know. Trump, right? Nice finish. Nice. Crazy from all bro. His uppers are a little bit like Gunther, I think. Like, yeah, it's, like, it's like different uppers. They're like different uppers than, the, than we've seen. He does it more from the neck, and while other people like do it more from their like, uh, the head stall. They go with the uh, flow. I like the style on the lowers on this guy. Nice combo. Oh, this is a good round of Ethan. Oh, yes. Oh, that's crazy. Oh, he recovered the mistake very nicely. Switch. Oh, I like that move. That was cool. The problem is, I think, is that like Ethan was has a really strong, had a really strong third yes. round. Yes. But the first two rounds were like, yes, like to come a bit into yes. the mood, and I think that's a bit too late to uh, make a difference uh, on stage. And if he does it like uh, did it in the first two rounds, I think he could uh, challenge Alvaro a bit better. Yes, I agree. Yes, fully agree. All right, let's have a look what the judges say. Yeah. Well, they're, the not saying, they're not saying fireman. anything, they're just doing like that. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but the, <laughs> the last round was fire, man. Yes, yes. And you have to consider that this guy is not even a freestyle football, he's a multimeter. So. So don't, you know, freestyle is also a, like an experience game. You can usually see that in the end, when we get to top 32, top 16, the most experienced guys usually yeah. go to the final. Yeah. Because they know when to do what, like, and exactly on the right moment. One yeah. Alvaro, Alvaro takes it and goes to the final on Saturday. Well done, Alvaro from Spain. All right, what's the next battle, uh, Mike? Fusion versus uh, UNG. Is it it's this one, I think? Corb against Oomph, right? Yeah, yeah. Holland against.